Congratulations. Davis Arena, your next match is set for one fall with a 10 minute time limit. Who is this guy and what is he wearing? The doctor has got something to say. Davis Arena, I'd like to tell you it was an honor to be here. If it wasn't before, me being in front of all of you redneck inbred hicks, just like Austin Bradley and Big J Lame, who are gonna be out here next. Let me introduce you to a real competitor, the one, the only, Miles Pentecost! So the doctor grabs the microphone and his purple pinstripe suit the doctor is and, and has the nerve to call somebody a hick? The people love Austin for some reason. Look at the signs in the crowd, the fans on their feet. And Big J plays, they've got signs for him too. What is he, John Travolta? Saturday Night Fever, give me a break. Terry Bodie with the introduction. And introducing his opponent, accompanied to the ring by Big J. Blaine, making his OVW and wrestling debut, Austin Bradley. And I have to go back to you, Iron Man. If you're in Austin, uh, Austin Bradley's shoes right now, you come out, the lights hit you, there's signs all over the crowd, you can feel the pulse, it's electric. What do you do with all that energy? You gotta, you can't get caught up in all the emotion. You gotta still look forward to your match, do what you've trained, and when you get in there, your instincts have to take over. You can't get so emotionally involved with the fans that you forget about your opponent. And then yeah, likewise, for uh, Mr. Pentecost, how do you not, how do you not let that affect you on the opposite side of the ring when you see your opponent has the fanfare? Again, they're not Wiley veterans. This is their first time out of the gate. Well, sometimes you, you do let it affect you in a positive way. When everybody's booing you, they're against you, and you got to use that for motivation. Obviously, the doctor has prepared Miles for anything that Austin Bradley has to is capable of. But obviously, he didn't have them prepared and scouted for that hip toss. Come on, doctor, do something. Seems Bradley and Penikoff in this opening moment of this matchup seem to have cut a high pace. You talked about breathing, breathing in the ring. I want to find out exactly what his credentials are as a doctor. I, I, what what field of medicine does he practice? Where did he train? You and me both, my friend. I want to know it if too, Iron Man. I went to Man. the doctor and I walked in and he was dressed like that, I think I would walk right out. Ask for a second opinion, would you? Well, my doctor kind of looks like that. It explains so much. Yeah, but look at, that, look at that little pit tweet over there. That little chump over there in the white suit. And it's shades know what he's of the doing. great Boss Brackens in the white suit over there. Somebody that he could emulate. Cover here, cover. Austin may not, this, this Austin is a bit off more than he can chew with this Miles Penikoff because obviously, you see, Miles, he's not a big guy. He probably is very smart to pick a manager like the doctor. For Austin Bradley, I talked to him earlier and back, he said it was a very emotional day for him. Not only the nerves is his first time competing in the ring, oh, and a shot to the low back into the kidneys, but he's dedicating this match to an old time wrestler who passed away last year uh, a guy by you you may know him iron man we got a cover here we got a cover you may know him iron man a guy by the name of phil ship deputy dog deputy dog yeah he wrestled in the louisville area for a long time wrestled at the louisville gardens you know he was somebody that everyone in the kentucky and area got a pleasure to watch wrestle for years. Well, apparently Mr. Ship took a liking to one Mr. Bradley. He used to bring him to shows for years. Of course, cover here. Of course, Deputy passed away last year, but. Miles cannot let this crowd deter him from his task at hand, and that's winning this match. Who cares what the fans are The cover again. But Austin believes that the deputy is looking down from above it's on him right now. It's a lot of pressure to put on yourself in your very first match to have you know, to dedicate your match to someone that was a mentor. And I think so far that's 
It's actually hurt him so far tonight. I think he's. You think that's in his I guts, think, in his I brain, to distract him a little bit? He's uh, distracted himself with his emotions. He's got him. He's got him locked up in there, wrenching it back. And look at this. Wow. From the doctor. Somebody needs like to suspend that. his that's medical good. license. Yeah, hurry, hurry, get out of the way. Are you giving instructions? No, I was just uh, kind of helping. Bowling out. through and through. Cover here, cover. You know, these guys are, it's their first pain, match, but they're wrestling like they're veterans, the way they're taking advantage of the rules and breaking them behind the referee's back. Look at the impressive strength on the part of Miles. Into the cover again. He's deceptively strong, Miles. He's got tremendous <laughs> ligament and tendon strength. His muscles way. are dense. <laughs> You're dense. Hi, 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 hi. Miles you keep pitching him, you keep pitching him, I'll keep knocking him down, all right? Big J's got him in Austin's corner right now. As the fans start to rally, chanting, let's go Austin, let's go Austin, it is Pentecost. The more confident. Sometimes when the crowd rallies behind you, it will give you just a split second of a second win. In football, they call it the 12th man effect. I know that the doctor paid off, I mean, invited a lot of people here tonight, so why are they acting like an oil painting over there? They should be cheering for Miles. Austin switches it up. That back elbow catches it just the right time. My goodness, off the top. But can he capitalize? He connected with it, but can he get over for the cover? Precious seconds going away, and senior official Will Elaine in the account. It's like he's got a tag team partner where this crowd's getting behind him. I can't believe them, Doctor. This is unbelievable. Who's going to get to their feet first? It looks like they got back up at the boat at the same time. But it's Miles. No, it's Austin. The switch off the rope. Power slam. Blades of Randy Orton with a power slam off the ropes. Block it, Miles. No. Spins it around into the drop kick. Up and down. He Almost. folded him over. He Almost. could probably end it right there. Should capitalize. Should capitalize. Five minutes gone. Five minutes remain. What's Austin got planned here? If he's not going for the cover, that means he's got something he up his sleeve. He must say something huge. Something better than that belly to back suplex. What's it going to be? A oh. stutter. A, A stutter. A awakening neck breaker. Pick out. Cover. Pick out. The doctor was sweating bullets over here. He's getting to his little uh, bottle of pills there to try to. Nightmare Danny Davis finish off many opponent with that same neck breaker. Getting those tranquilizers. Get him. Get him, doctor. Get him. Uh oh, uh oh. Austin will waste a little bit too much time up there. He just knocked the man down. And Big J Blaine. What the hell? Big J's taking matters into his own hands. The world is going on around this place. Only look, the only place to see managers fighting to. Pinnacoff pushed off the top. Blaine, Perch, what's it going to be? Frog splash. Alighting girl, oh, man. He's a winner. Austin Bradley. With tears welling up in his eyes, what a moment it is for Austin, for young Austin Bradley. I just want to say, it's an honor to come and perform in front of my hometown and make my debut here in Louisville, Kentucky. I want to dedicate this match to my fallen mentor and friend, Deputy Dog, AKA Phil Schiff. Thank you. What a moment. What a memory for this young man. You got to give him a hand. You only get a chance to make one debut, and I think he can be proud of that for the rest of his career.